We now request the transformational lady, Mrs. Arundhati Bhattacharya, to please come and inspire us. My dear students, guardians, teachers of this fantastic institution, the trustees, members of the Lalbhai family, Sri Sunil Lalbhai. First and foremost, I must tell you that today has been an amazing day. I started the day with a visit to the vocational institution that has been set up uh, by Atul. And I visited its classes. I saw the kind of training that is being given to the large number of tribal men and women. And what I was most amazed at is its placement record, which is much better than many B schools and many engineering institutions. Subsequently, after coming to Atul, I have also been to the Inspiration Center. And really speaking, all of you students who must have been to the Inspiration Center, I don't think you need any inspirational teachers or lectures. Because one walk through that Inspiration Center will give you enough to make you go through life with your head held high. At some portion of my life, I used to live in the campus of IIT Kharagpur. And we used to find that once the children became old enough, every single one of them appeared for the JE exams. And if the child did not clear the JE exam, that entire household would go into mourning. And mourning means real mourning. There would be no lights, they would cease to come to gatherings, there would be no parties, no celebrations. Now, imagine the kind of pressures that these children were under. I realize the one thing that you need to be in life is to be a good family person. And that is why today, when I see children, when I see their parents, I feel it is very important to remember that only getting good marks in your examination, getting a job that pays you a seven-figure salary is not the be end and the end, end, end of life. If you smile, then all of the trials that come to you, they become much lighter. They are not so heavy. At the end of the day, tell me, even if you are in trouble, if you make a big long face, is the trouble going to go away? Is the trouble going to become any less? But in spite of the trouble, if you can smile, actually speaking, the trouble becomes less. It actually does. Also, for all the children, let me tell you something else. There will be setbacks in life. There will be failures in life. There is no life where there is no setback. You just now saw a gentleman a hero who had such a setback in his life that he lost a hand and yet went on to win not one but two gold medals in the Olympics for India. So setbacks in life will be there. You have to determine what that setback does to you. So basically never think that a temporary setback is something that is really a misfortune for your entire life. Fortune and misfortune, they come and they go. But you must have the ability, the courage, and the integrity to stay true to what you believe is correct and to manage your life accordingly. Do you think anybody in this world has been kept back because he failed? All of us will pass, meaning that all of us one day will be dead. All of us will pass. There is no failure in this life. Never fear failure because you must know that this life is one which where you have come to learn. No matter whether it is good or bad, from every incident, you must draw a lesson. If you can do that, then all of us will have passed successfully. 
so for all of you my best wishes i know that the kind of values that you are imbibing in this fantastic institution will help you lead the kind of life that one needs to live lead it will help you to become really worthy citizens of this great country of ours so be true to your ideals learn from your teachers from your seniors and make sure that the contribution that you can whatever be it for the country that you do not hold back for that and that you do your best in order to make your country proud thank you so much